In today's video, I'm going to talk about a couple of uh, somewhat advanced reporting uh, t topics related to editing reports. So if you're a beginner, you probably don't want to be looking at this video at this point, maybe later on. Anyway, uh, let's get started. So what I'm going to do is show you how to add a title to a report on the fly when you're outputting the report. So first of all, I'm going to let me show you first the CoinList 2. This is one of, our, one of our older, more simple reports. And what this does when I output it now, so I'll just click on Preview. It's just going to print a list of the coins. And this uh, title here is hard-coded. I mean, you could change it by editing the report, but if you want to change it on the fly each time you run the report, there's a, there's a better way to do that. What I'm going to do is Edit Report. I'm going to select the report that corresponds to that menu item. Click open. I'm going to save it under a different name because that's always a good idea. Uh, you don't want to be changing a report associated with a menu item until you're sure that it works. Uh, so let me save as. I'm just going to call this My Coin Standard 2. Click save. Now to make this title uh, something you can add on the fly, type in your title when you run the report. I'm first going to delete the text here. And I'm going to click on insert. And there is a form control field here. Click on form control. Put it right here. Now, what this what this form control does is every time you run the report, if you output the preview, you can type in the name of the report. And when you subsequently print it or print it to a PDF, you will see that new title. So I'm going to save this, exit the report designer. Let me run the report. Output report using all data. There we go. Click on the report I just created. I'm going to print a preview. And this is where I can input the, the new title. So I'll click preview. I could type in. And now, once I've entered the new title, I can print it. If I just want to print it out to the uh, to my printer, I can do that. And it will show this, this as the title of a the report or I can export it so let's say I want to export it to a PDF format yeah it's the um, second to drop down there Adobe PDF format type in a name make sure this little checkbox is cleared is uh, checked so that it will open the PDF file you can see what it looks like click Save On my other screen, I output the report, and, and as you can see here, we have a PDF file, and my custom title is now the title of the report. The second task I'm going to show you is how to add a link to a website, or you can also add, actually add a link to a hard-coded uh, file um, within a report. So I'm going to click Reporting again, Edit Report, My Coin Standard 2. Now what I can do, uh, let's say I just want to have a link to a website, my my website or my eBay sales page or whatever down here. I'm going to click on insert, text. And once I've the text has been added, I can enter what will show in the text. So let me say, let's say coin book. Click OK. Now, when I have this selected, you'll notice down here, there's a link URL section in the properties. So within quotes, it's important to keep it within quotes. I'll put the link, which will, when I click on USA Coin Book, after I have outputted the report to, for example, PDF format, when I click on this link, it will take me to that website. So HTTP. You do make sure you have the double quotes here because if you don't, so you're going to see red. That means if it's 
if the background is red, it means there's an error and the report's not going to work properly. So make sure this is an in with within quotes. And now I'm going to save. Go through the same procedure to output the report and preview. Now again, I can enter the title of the report and when I click on this link here, USA Coinbook, you're gonna see the USA Coinbook website. Now again, this only applies when you output the re report to PDF or preview format. So uh, that's a couple of uh, things you may be interested in learning about reporting and editing reports. Thanks for watching.